What's going on gamers? It's your boy iMaverick aka Mr. Touchdown Glitch and no, I am not the best Madden player in the world. I'm alright though and I bring you guys my very first Madden 13 online ranked match gameplay video. Try saying that three times. Now this isn't my very first online ranked match that I'm showing you, but it is my first video as far as Madden 13 is concerned and the online ranked arena. And it's a decent one, at least for us anyway. We're rolling with the Steelers, taking on the Texans. And I'm running the Pearl Harbor scheme that I created on offense. On defense, I'm running Dreams quarter defense. And, you know, we're pretty effective this game. And as of now, I'm definitely thinking that the Steelers are going to be my team. Uh, but that's hard for me to really speak on too much because I've only played with the Steelers, the Eagles, and the Browns. I know what you're thinking, like, yo, man, that's such a strange combination. Why go from the Steelers, you know, maybe Steelers to Eagles, but why are, Why is the Browns one of the first three teams you played with? Well, I just released my Pearl Harbor offensive scheme. That's available on the website, MaddenMastermind.com. And I was, you know, I was writing up a little promo video, and I was like, you know what? I was going to put, you know, works with every team. And I was like, hold up now. Now, I've tried a lot of the practice, a lot of the different teams in practice mode, but I haven't really, you know, and I've run unranked matches with other teams, but I haven't hopped in the online ranked arena. So let's see what that's about. So I went with the Browns, you know, and I ran my Pearl Harbor scheme. So I'll have that video for you guys tomorrow. You may have already noticed something a little bit different about this video. No super crazy intro with the commentary cam. And it's all my fault, y'all. Your boy, your boy's a scholar. Because see, what happened was... I went to set up the commentary camp for this game. I was like, yo, we about to be the Steelers. About to get these hit stick fumbles. Commentary camp freakouts. This video is going to be insane. And so I set the tripod up. Got the camera on top. And I hit the red button because the red button is what usually means record. But what happened was I still had it on picture mode. So, you know, and the volume was down too. So I hit the little, little red button and it took a picture. You know, my happy self thought I was recording. I sat down, did the whole game, went back. I was like, yeah, let's see what these cams is looking like. And it was just one picture, like, of my chest. So, my fault, y'all, but don't trip. The game for tomorrow, which is going to be the Cleveland Browns game. And the one after that will be the Eagles. And I already have commentary cams for those. Those are already chopped up. So, don't trip. I was like, you know what? Let me give them this game first since I messed up on the commentary cam. Because you don't want to go from commentary cam back to no commentary cam. That's just... That's just no bueno. But, so look out for those tomorrow. Also tomorrow, we're going to have full game Friday back for the Madden 13 season. I can't wait. I know that's some of your guys' favorite parts of the week is the full game Friday. Now, we're going to have, it's looking like we're going to have two full game Fridays. Let me know what you guys think about this. Is that going to be too much information for you to digest? Myself and Dream Killers are both thinking of doing a full game Friday for tomorrow. Let us know how you feel about that. Now, for those who don't know who Dream Killers is, Dream Killers is staff on our website, MaddenMastermind.com. He's going to have a lot of videos going up this year, way more than last year. And actually, he's going to have one later tonight. As soon as my video hits a video, uh, hits a view freeze, which means, you know, the views freeze at 300 views, we're going to drop his, his video. It, it's his first money game of the year. You know, Dream's big into the money game. He's so greedy. Dream's always whooping on someone in the money game. Me, that's never really been my thing. I tried it at the beginning of Madden 12, but all I did was bum hunt. And for those that just ain't the beast in Madden, I'm a little bit, I'm a lot better now than I was back then. But I'm not ashamed, I'm not afraid to admit that I was bum hunting like a mug on Virgin. And I know some of y'all out there did the same thing. Don't even try to shake your head at me because I know y'all did till you get on Virgin. And for those who don't know how it works, they, they have tournaments or they had bracket tournaments. And they would rank you from level 0 to 5 and level 5 to 10. And I would just sit there and make sure I was only playing, you know, level 5 tournaments. I would make sure I lose, like, games on purpose so I stayed low. Like, I was like, I just don't want to get up there and lose my money versus those good guys. So, yeah, I was a big bum hunter earlier in the season. Then they took away their bracket tournaments. And then I just stopped playing. But Dream, he's always on the money games. Uh, another staff member on the site, T-Raw. T-Raw is big on the money games, and I don't want to feel left out, so I think I'm going to start hopping in those. You guys will see some of those coming up shortly. Myself playing money games. Also got some streams coming up. Hope you guys are excited about that. We're going to do weekly streams, and we're thinking about Tuesday being the day. 
For now, we're gonna do it on Twitch. I'm still waiting for my settings on YouTube to get figured out so that I can stream via YouTube. Then we'll go ahead and move it over there. But the streams are coming from Madden 13. Full Game Friday's coming. We also got our weekend review series, which you guys are gonna get on Saturday, where we actually do a post commentary on a full game, break things down for you. A lot of people wanted to see that. So, I mean, really, it seems like we started the Madden 13 season off slow because this is our first video and what the game's been out two full days if you go if you had the season ticket well like five days but we've been having a lot of stuff going on in the background we've been in the lab coming up with schemes and schemes and you know developing content for the site so it may seem like just looking at our YouTube channel we haven't been busy but I'm willing to bet we've you know we've probably put if not the most we're up there as far as people putting hours into the game and you know just getting stuff ready for the community so uh, we've, we've dropped two ebooks right now we have the Pearl Harbor and Dreams Quarter defense now those are both paid guys I know a lot of y'all you're like man you know we in a recession man my pockets kinda tight right now I can't afford the guy don't even trip we know that and we love the Madden community we know some of y'all can pay for the guys some of you guys just can't afford it don't stress it that's why every week we're gonna be doing the full game Fridays but we're gonna hop into a different playbook you know, every week, you know, break and with a different team and break down a scheme for you, for you to take, you know, and do do whatever you do with it. And this year for Full Game Friday, we're actually going to start the videos in practice mode where we show you guys the scheme. And for those that don't want to watch the scheme, we'll just have an annotation or we'll timeline it, timeline it in the description so you can just skip straight to the game. Because we get into the game sometimes, and we don't actually run the entire scheme just based on how our opponent's playing or whatever it is. So for those that want to digest the scheme at a deeper level, we'll have that at the beginning, maybe at the end. Don't quote me on that. You'll see tomorrow with Full Game Friday. We may even have it as an annotation for a separate video. Feel free to leave your feedback in the comments section. You know, this is a channel for the people, by the people. But that's something we definitely want to add to this year because, you know, especially y'all know how I get down. I'll run the same play all game if they let me. I'll sit there and run a halfback dive all game and you guys didn't even get to digest the scheme. So at least when it's in practice mode, you get to see, you know, everything in its entirety and it may not play out in the game like that. So uh, be aware of that. And also, the AIM chat is in full effect. If you want to join the AIM chat, Leave your, your AIM username in the description. If you don't have an AIM, go get an AIM. If you don't know what AIM is, that's AOL Instant Messenger. Now, what the AIM group is, it's just a big place for us all to come together as Madden heads and talk about the game of Madden. We did this for the end of last year, and it was awesome. It kind of died down because, you know, we all got sick of the game. But now with Madden just dropping, it's going to be in full effect. You know, I'm going to be in there. Dream's going to be in there. Chappie's going to be in there. You know, the Madden Students guy's going to be in there from time to time. I'm going to get Chappie and Golden Sports in there. So it's going to it's gonna be a good time. So definitely be on the lookout for that. If you want to join, you need to leave your name in the comments. Get the username and let us know what it is. Uh, another heads up. You need to have downloaded the AIM, the AIM app. You need to go to the website AIM.com and download it. If you're trying to use AIM Express... You're not going to get the invite when I invite you to the group because it's invite only. And that and that does mean our, our block cane is really strong. We'll boot someone in an instant. If you come up in the AIM chat talking greasy, thinking you're bad, this and that, we'll, nah, it's a non-stunting zone. Just come there, be friendly, learn some things, give some info. You know, we talk about everything from Madden to, to other video games, real sports talk, NBA. It's just a real cool hangout spot. So if you do anything that threatens that vibe that we got going on, we'll boot you without a warning. You're just going to log on and you're going to be out the group. So yeah, let us know. Now, if you're watching this video after the first week, so look at the date on this video. If it's been a week since this video's dropped, you might have to send me a message on AIM. Now, my AIM is iMaverick. Just like it's spelled on all the beginning of my videos and my, and my games, it's just iMaverick. I'll have a link in the description or the, the name in the description. Send me a message on AIM. And I'll have a couple of our moderators' names there, too, so you guys can send us a message and we'll add you. We won't be checking these comments on this video through the entire season. We just can't do that. So for the first week, we'll check all the comments, add you to the group, and from then on, you're going to have to get at us on AIM, and we'll add you from there. If you're into Madden and you like talking Madden, I highly suggest it for you. Uh, some more things to be on the lookout for. Like I said, Dream will be doing videos. T-Raw hasn't dropped a video yet, but T-Raw will be dropping videos. 
if you guys can't tell the channel is branded as Madden Mastermind you know not the IMAV Mastermind because you know I'm, I'm all about finding the best the best players and getting them on the team to help you guys get better because that's why I started the site and and that's what I want to do I want to help guys improve their Madden game and a little background on Dream Killers Dream uh, you know, he's like my Madden mentor. You know, he really helped me get to the next level in Madden. I, I was doing all right when I first met him, but he really showed me how to laugh. He showed me this and that. And he, we constantly laughed and got better together. And I give him a lot of credit to where I, for where I'm at right now. So Dream knows a lot. Dream actually knows more than me. And t Raw is the beast at the game. As we ended the Madden 12 season, t Raw was spanking me because he has no conscience. And, you know, he doesn't value our friendship like that. So he's they're, they're both very good players. And I'm always looking to get people that are better than me so they can bring that knowledge to you guys in these videos and on the website. So don't be alarmed, you know, when the white man, Dream Killers, hops on and does his. I don't, I don't know what T-Raw is. T-Raw, T-Raw's a mutt. I can't tell. He's like, he's like a, a black dude with a big birthmark that's just white. So I don't know. But either way blue white black or green just don't be surprised when you don't hear my voice on a video because it's just someone else from the site trying to help you guys out and we're all going to bring different vibes i know some people can't stand my high energy and my yelling so don't worry dream don't yell dream's actually very calm and collected so you'll have that option of watching his full game fridays over mine if that's what you want to do now this man this man initially, and I'm, I'm hopping into the gameplay commentary if you can't tell. Now, I'm sorry, I'm kind of all over the place. But this man rejected my mercy earlier in the game. And then wants to come back and just thinks he can concede. Now, I'm all down with someone not accepting mercy. Because that's what I would do if I was getting whooped. I'd be like, man, forget that. You're going to keep whooping me because, I'm, you know, you learn from losses. So I'm not one to run away. I like to stay in it, keep trying, you know, figure out why what I'm doing isn't working. So cool, he rejected it. All right, but now all of a sudden when it starts to get even worse, you just want to concede. Nah, I don't work like that. Because now I want to work on some things on offense and defense. So you're going to have to ride this butt whooping out. But as you guys see, the, the Pro Harbor scheme's in full effect. We're putting up points and bunches. My defense isn't where, it's, you know, where it should be yet. I'm definitely having to outscore a lot of my opponents that I play. Uh, the dream scheme is definitely getting me my stops. I'm just still, you know, it has that little tiny learning curve that really, and once you master that learning curve, you're really a beast on defense. But, yes, yeah, so if you're looking for the defensive gameplays, definitely going to be one to watch Dream Killers videos more so than mine. At this point, I'm still in the lab trying to develop some of my own stuff to kind of throw on top of his, his defense, and then I'll pretty much be a beast. But, yeah, we're just, you know, just mixing in. You know, the, the man beaters with the zone beaters throwing in a little bit of run here and there. And we're really tough to stop on offense. It's, I don't like to call anything the best or say that you're just completely unstoppable. But only time I see myself struggling on offense is when I make bad reads. You know, as long as I'm staying calm, you know, making the right reads, the open players are there. The scheme is on point. It's just about me, you know, making the right decision. But yeah, this, I mean, the, the opponent started off strong. You know, I thought this was going to be a little bit more of a competitive game at jump. But as you see, we kind of ran away with it. Pro Harbor proved to be a little bit too much for him. But hey, what can we do? But yeah, guys, appreciate you rocking with me. This game's coming to an end. Be on the lookout for a Dream Killers video dropping later tonight. We're also going to drop two of our promo videos for our eBooks. Uh, look out for the free schemes coming tomorrow. Two full game Fridays and the weekend review series coming on Saturday. But that's all I got to say, guys. I'm done rambling. Appreciate you spending your time with me on this video. I'm going to peace out. Until next time, God first, God bless.